Shane, we're here to check out the Boss PS2 pitch shifter and delay pedal. This has six different modes on it. The first mode is 125 milliseconds delay. Mode two is 500 milliseconds delay. Number three is two seconds delay. And then we get into the pitch shifters from four, five, and six. We can manually set it on number four. Number five is one octave above and number six is one octave below. A huge thanks to Mojo Stomp Boxes for sending this out. I absolutely appreciate it. If you want to find out more about Mojo Stomp Boxes, the links will be on screen and down below in the description. Let's go. All right, let's kick this off. I'm playing my Fender Stratocaster loaded with some Zex Coil pickups into my Fender Super Reverb Reissue Amplifier on the Vibrato channel. And this is my clean tone. <laughs> And now with the pedal on. It's got that bathroom delay sound, you know what I mean? less of it in the mix you can turn the balance down all right the feedbacks like the amount of repeats so the further up it is the more repeats you get Sounds a bit funky on this one. If we turn this down, the repeats are a little slower. It's getting into crazy territory right there. Let's go ahead and flick the switch to preset number two, which is where it was set on the intro. This is my personal favorite. Probably shouldn't have thrown that ninth chord in there, but anyway, it doesn't matter. If you're into even more wet signal stuff, simply turn up the balance. It'll get pretty crazy now. I know on camera that's gonna look out of sync, but it's not. It's actually sort of behind where I'm actually playing now. So I've got the balance so far up. So back to 12 o'clock. Let's go ahead and turn the feedback up so it's gonna repeat more and I like the slower kind of vibe. So let's try this.
the kind of ambient effects that I love to just record some intro music with. These kind of effects are great for that ambient sound. Just that particular setting is fantastic. All right, this next one should be interesting. It says it's two second delay. Let's try this. Doesn't, I don't know. I don't know if that's exactly two seconds, but anyway, where it's set right now still sounds great. That's pretty cool, man. I like that a lot. That's just another great thing for coming up with ambient parts. Sounds really cool. Let's go ahead, slow that down, turn the feedback up and turn the balance up, or I should say down, so we're getting more wet signal. All right, I can tell now it's a lot slower than before. So two seconds might be the maximum. <laughs> cool man, people who are more creative with that stuff than me will get a kick out of that for sure. Alright, over to number four. I know it looks like the dial set to three, but we're actually on number four. This is a pitch shifter. Where it's set right now is going to sound very, very prominent. So I'll show you quickly how it sounds. It's got that seasick weird thing going on. So let's turn the balance back this way, make it a little bit less prominent. Alright, if we turn this one to the left, it's going to bring in a bit more lows. Yeah, it's still more musical than a rig, ring modulator, but uh, not my thing. So let's skip over here. Let's go to the next one. Over to number five now, and this particular sound is that of, uh, it's like an octave above. So let's give this a shot. <laughs> the chords very very well actually let's go ahead and turn the balance up Churchy, very organy. Organy? Is organy a word? <laughs> Alright, and the last setting now is one octave below. This should be fun. I'm going to put everything back to 12 o'clock just to start off and take it from there. Alright, over to number six, which is the last one. This is an octave below the actual guitar signal, so let's try this. <laughs> Let's make it wetter. So you can't really hear any of the actual guitar signal in there. If I go this way, the opposite will happen.
that's kind of nice where it is. I'm just going to turn that up just a hair. So you're hearing more of the guitar now, but with that overtone. <laughs> You solo on for, you know, most of your, your songs is like this. And then you just want one with a lot of attitude. Yeah, probably not great for the chords. Actually, it's fine for the chords. I just hit a bad chord. Yeah man, cool. Thanks for watching, my name's Shane. If you have any comments, questions or suggestions about the pedal or the demo, please let me know and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Let me know what you think of the tones of this and if you've had a chance to try one or you already own one, let me know your thoughts on how to use it as well. A huge thanks to Mojo Stomp Boxes for allowing me to demo this, I absolutely appreciate it. If you want to find out more about them, all the links will be on screen and down below. Catch you all soon. See ya. Mm -hmm.